and welcome back for another episode of Ben Roland playing the Old Republic. Today we are, well, at least right now, we are turning in quests before we move on to the next area. Ha <laughs> ha! That was great! I can see those strikes come down from here! After that display, I'm going to recommend the final model be named in your honor. I'd like to hang on to this targeter for a while. Addictive, isn't it? I'm afraid the prototype wasn't intended for sustained use. We'll be collecting the Delta A5 soon to make adjustments based on the data you provided. Here's a little something on behalf of the project. It's been a pleasure. Yeah, new armoring. Endurance or strength. Uh, I'm going to take the endurance. We gotta talk to this dude. You've brought me readings? Excellent! It looks like you were able to conduct many scans. Did the droids pose much of a threat when you encountered them? It was quite a fight. This situation could have been avoided entirely if Command would acknowledge my requests for a security detail. You've ensured that Tatooine will hold no secrets from the Empire. Thank you. How the hell did he get a lightsaber? <laughs> it's an offhand and no. I'm gonna take the commendation. Alright. So now we are ready to move on to the at least the Reclamation Services base camp up here. So we'll see what's happening there. Alright, let's take care of this quickly so we can uh, move on to the last area and uh, get to this Jedi Master that so desperately wants to die. Hale, check on Keeler and the others. See if they figured out anything with the artifact. Sir, I'd like to hear what happened. Follow orders. I'll brief everyone later. I've sent for water and Kalto, my lord. I'm sure the desert was agonizing, but we've been waiting for word. Any sign of Darth Silva? Trust me, you don't want that man back. So... He really didn't make it, then. Damn it! We all felt it, but we weren't sure. We're not blasted Sith. Without Sylva, we're just archaeologists with guns. Without him, this whole expedition falls apart. I think you're out of luck, then. I guess since Sylva brought you into this, now you're out. Weapons malfunction, small reactor leak. <laughs> Captain Gola! Last hail, now's not the time. The artifact, the one that Jawas found, it's got Kayla. We disabled the dampeners, and there was a flash. What? Start containment procedures now! Too late. Zekian, a test divertini. Your life is about to end. Zahros de dies, tekesh marwar. Right. 
Is upon us. I got you. My death is imminent. Oh, you're fine. up real quick. No, we don't need it. It would be nice to be fully healed for the next time I get into some crap. Those creatures. They were my team. Sir, I think Perrin escaped. He was heading into the desert toward the tribal settlement. Blast. We'll mourn later. You remember the sons of Palawa. You hit them hard in Mas Ila, but their main village is just a few clicks out. If that creature reaches them, this could get very ugly. How did you come up with that? Basic rule of Xenoarchaeology. You don't unleash a foreign technology into a population center. Especially one with a man-machine interface. Worst case, the technology that changed Perrin could replicate. Every person in the settlement could be transformed. If it transforms them, so be it. I don't care what your grudge is. We can't let an outbreak occur. Reclamation Service Protocol for Contaminated Sites mandates atomic heat cleansing of everything within a hundred meter radius. We've got a store of beradium explosives for that purpose. Enough to obliterate the Sun's cave village. But I hope it won't come to that. We should have destroyed the tribals long ago. If you say so. Get to the caves. Maybe you'll catch Perrin before he's transformed a whole army. Give me a belt. Eh, that's a little bit of an upgrade. Do, 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 do I want to take it though? For one strength and one endurance? Nah. I will pass. Alright. So we have to head to the Sons of Palawa, which will run us into Teak. Or. Whatever the hell his name was. What I say it was before Veeb? <laughs> well, either way. And he'll have a quest for us to deal with robots. So let's get started here. And here he is. Oh, it's Cheek. Ripok nani kari mariaka. Akam ja lebik memarik. Memyuka hal hal krama. Nick Nurga Nalu Nem Neraka Bragam Nemya Inubuyan Akamanka Amkananya. I don't take orders from aliens. Um nok inu nemnu Amka Aka mem perlak palak Nem panu koragin Penguana nemu ka mime Manu Meraka Naja Kinamabam. Yakmanala. I'll determine if your device is worth the Empire's investment. Nakag agib kik benabab. Neya agam berakaki. Beraka karam kara. Eninyamak oramag yang megik. Kamperem ganyam baji yang. Manikikum bukam. Alright, so let's see. That's not it. That's the one. Alright, so this is pretty easy. Go outside. Eh. Where is one? There he is. Hi. No, I don't think so. You will not win this day. And done. And there's another one. That's not one. 
this is. <laughs> See, there's one over there. I don't know if I can get to him though. Or I can just go after that one. that is. I didn't have to stop to heal, I didn't have to fight a bunch of extra mobs. And here we go. I've finished testing. Your device works. Naya memgem kaligam. Gegwa nam karak naya memak. Mamni lebek bak manuk. Meraka naja ki nama bamyak. Yukagi ne paninu, ham kambina bek nemu kemgram. Uh, sure. You're stable. Pants for him. I'm gonna say no. All right. Now we just gotta head to the cave. Let's see. Correctly, I hook here, and then, whoa, let's not get that close. And into the cave, and no one's going to attack me because they're preoccupied, possibly afraid of me. A little bit of both. You! I knew the Empire used dishonorable tactics, but the ghost of the desert, do you know what it does to people? The transformation is impressive. Within the first minute, that terror changed good villagers into murderous machines. There's a war going on in these caves. Now I'll give my brothers the chance to win by keeping you from interfering. You'll die along with everyone else in this village. Ha! For Palawa, I'll fight until our blood becomes an oasis. You will not win this day! still have to go in here where the other guys are.
expected that to be a difficult fight. Sure you did. Only the strong ones count. So I have to go back here to set the bomb and kill Perrin while I'm at it. So, yeah! Drop the blue. The fight is upon us. I will take it. What do I get? Might mud ten. Eh, sure, why not? I haven't even put those in anything. Although. My new helmet will uh, now have all that. <laughs> as soon as I level. Alright, so we killed Perrin, set the bomb. Now I have to set the other bomb on my way out of here. Or is there another bomb? Yes, there is another bomb. Mm-hmm. 
It's the last bomb. Somebody like come out here and just clear people out, or do they? I don't know. I don't know what happened there. Kind of surprised there wasn't people outside waiting for me because that's where they're supposed to be. All right, so back into here, so we can get out of here. move on to the last area as soon as we talk to this guy are the power readings stable yes sir the stasis fields online keep it that way I don't want the artifact powering up again I heard the explosion I take it the contamination sites been cleared the screams the fires Beautiful stuff. It's a pity. Even tribals don't deserve to be obliterated because of some alien relic. Those artifacts Zerka found, they must be capable of infecting people, transforming them. I don't know why you'd build a device like that. But some species did long before humans lived on Tatooine. And the Reclamation Service has the job of bringing those artifacts home. Are you with us? Where Darth Silthar failed, I will succeed. As you say, my lord. Without a Sith on the expedition, we'd be at a loss, I'm sure. What we've just experienced, the artifact powering on the takeover, I'm willing to bet Zerka went through the same thing. If we knew where to start looking for Zerka's base, we could scan for the artifact's power signal, track down the laboratory. Too bad Silpha didn't get more data. The base is in the Sand People's Cursed Land. These drawings should show the way. This? It's primitive, but it looks like a native map. We'll check its age. Calculate the geographical changes since its creation. I think we have it, sir. The native's forbidden zone is in Sector 22G. I can start outfitting a probe immediately. Once you're in position, use this signal device to call the droid. It'll launch from here. In the meantime, we've got friends to bury. And you have fun with that. Uh, let's see here. Uh, sure, why not? I suppose I could always use an implant. And so can our boy Quinn. Even if it does have strength on it. <laughs> Uh, better you get some endurance out of another item slot. Alright, so all that's left is to head off to the next camp. Alright, here we are. We got some quests to take. Major Brager, at your service. I'm honored that you've graced this dismal planet with your presence. 
We were so close to expanding Imperial influence, introducing refinement to this rock. If you can spare a moment, we may still have a chance. I'm listening. What's your trouble? There's a well, one of Tatooine's deepest and most successful. Whoever controls it, controls this region. Imperial Command ordered me to take it, but my men were butchered by sand people, no less. This tribe so ruthless, all the other tribes pay them tribute. The Empire can't let these filthy savages control such a priceless resource. I will end their rule. Excellent. I can't wait to hear of your victory. The well lies deep in the desert. Kill the sand people who guard it. The Empire will be grateful. Yeah, well, they better. Let's see, talk to you. Ah, perhaps we stand a chance after all. It's a relief to see you, my lord. The entire Empire may one day have cause for gratitude that you arrived here at precisely this moment. Your name, now. I am Officer Vengo, Imperial Reclamation Service. My men and I were escorting prison laborers to a Zerka dig site. We were ambushed by a bunch of Republic cowards who cut down my men and freed the prisoners. There was a Jedi leading them. As it happens, this wouldn't be the first Jedi I've crossed. Perfect, my lord. It's a chance to bring the Emperor's justice to these zealots. I've already overloaded the prisoners' shock collars. They should be quite injured. According to my sensors, they've stopped moving. I expect they've gone to ground in the deep desert to tend the wounded. If you want to help, track them there and make sure they never leave. I believe that's the heroic. I will, as usual, make oh, an sir. attempt, I guess. Sorry to bother you, but I'm running inventory on our water rations. Hello. That's right. I'm talking to you. I know who you are, and I bring a proposal. I'm Shale Tassau. I speak for a small consortium of the Exchange on Tatooine. They want a warlord dead, and they think you're the one to do it. Makes me sweat. I need my bar. You think I'll work for crime lords? Oh. Are you an upstanding citizen? I assure you, I have the public safety in mind. The target is the warlord Garbodia. He killed a Sith apprentice sent to assassinate him. And it's costing all of us. Imperials are torturing and killing exchange members to find his location. Now, I know where Gar is, but I came to you. Understand why? This means nothing to me. You can do a service to the Empire and profit at the same time. Gar and his mercenaries are hiding in the desert. I saw them taking shade by a derelict sand crawler. We can pay for his head. That ugly bantha stain is done. The Empire agrees, the Exchange agrees. How about you? The Sith do not fail. This warlord will learn that. Good. Now, he does move around a lot. Don't expect to find him exactly at the Sandcrawler. You bring me his head, and I'll bring you the credits. Bit, uh, ruthless of her. <laughs> but, hey. Whatever. Displaying all authorized destinations. Alright, so I will head off into the desert in the next episode, and we will go find ourselves a Jedi. Until then, I thank you for watching. Please subscribe, comment, all that fun stuff, and I will see you next time.